We were on Cooper Road today. It's a three bedroom, two bath house. It does have a one car garage and it has another parking spot over here. Just had the sore replaced, so that's why the front yard's dug up. Okay, this is the living room here. Does have nice hardwood floors. This is the dining area. Does have a built in dishwasher and disposal. Nice solid surface countertops. Um, actually, it does not have a disposal. Um, the appliances do stay, but the owner is not responsible for them. But they're all functional now, including the washer and dryer. This is bedroom number one. Bathroom number one. Bedroom number two. Gonna walk outside. That jacuzzi there does not work and it's being removed. It does have a nice big backyard. And there's a nice fire pit over here. And then it does have this real big patio back here. There's a lot of storage space up here. The master bedroom's up here. Um, there is, this is the master bedroom. It does have like a vaulted ceiling. And then there's a big walk-in closet there. And then this is the bathroom. There's a bunch of storage over here. And then the cool thing about the bathroom is it has a double shower. So there's one there, and then one around the corner there, and then plus that cute little ledge there. Okay, we're going to head for the basement now. There's like a sort of semi-finished family room down here. It's not super finished, but then there's the garage. The garage door, it's a little on the small side, but there's some extra storage up there. It does have a super high efficiency furnace. More storage down here. And over here, and again, the washer and dryer do stay and are functional, but the owner is not responsible for repairing them if they break. And that's it for our tour of Cooper Road.